Hello guys, it's your boy the Hurricane once again and welcome to my channel. As far as my channel is concerned, I take you to the places of interest, the tourist attractions, the mud seas in our continent and in Ghana. Um, a very nice, peaceful and serene natural environment here at the ranch. The Green Ranch, yeah. It's one of the peaceful, serene environment that you probably need to experience. Just come over here, have a look at how the place is very quiet conducive if you want to meditate just come down here there are a lot of uh, horses here um, natural accommodations here on which we are coming to explore so just come along with me as uh, we explore if today happens to be your first time watching my video i'll play with you that i just hit the subscription button to increase the following also if you have anything pertaining to our tourism journey just leave it at the comment section if you have something that you want uh, an information about you can leave it at the comment section i'm gonna give you information on that um also if you've been with me throughout this journey thanks so much for the love and support you are the ones motivating me to do this video if there are more things to add up in order to make uh, the video very attractive just leave that at the comment section and we promise to add more value to it so just come along with me as we explore uh the green ranch here at the lakeside around Lake Bosom Tree in the Ashanti region of Ghana. So just come along with me. Okay. <laughs> I just love the place, the place is very beautiful, very beautiful for someone like me who loves nature. I'm getting carried away, I'm getting carried away by what I'm seeing. So far I'm very impressed with what I'm seeing now. Come on, come on.
for the horse ride with my mother. Going to start. Okay. We are going to walk the horses from here on the way to the other flat road okay. and climb on their back from there where it's leveled. So we will walk one after the other. I'll show you how you will walk with the horse. It's an easy process. The horses do it all the time. They are cool. But basically we will go here, turn left, walk the round the road down all the way to the signboard and take a left. Okay. Walk about 30 or 40 yards away from the entrance, right. so more or less behind or below the banana trees. Yeah. And then we will stop and let them eat grass. In the meantime, they're eating peacefully. I'll come and help you climb on the back of your horse. And then you can come. You will take the ropes long. So you stay in front of your horse with long rings and you are first, your horse is after you. Go! Are you from the Caribbean? From where? Are you a Caribbean? No, I'm a French Iber. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm a Ghanaian by heart. <laughs> yeah, 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 no. It's <laughs> perfect. Are you from Monaco or Paris? No, I'm from the countryside. Oh, okay. Where there are mountains and rivers. Wow. So, um, why, why are they coming here? Coming to Ghana? Yes. Well, I fell in love with the lake. Okay. When I traveled wow. back to here, the lake was one of the most beautiful places I saw. Yeah. Hi, guys. So, my madam fell in love with the lake and she flew all the way from France to Ghana. And we are here. We are not embracing what we have. Man, let's embrace what we have. And she set up a very nice and beautiful place over here. Guys, just come down and have a pool of nature. The place is very beautiful. You probably need to experience this. It's my first time um, taking a horse ride and whoa, I'm so tense up. You wanna feed a bit? Keep going. Time for the horse to take me something. So you turn left, you walk about 30 yards. Okay. Find a spot in the shade, yeah. either move. And stop there, let the horse eat. eat. Okay. So for how long uh, has this establishment been in existence? Oh, I built it in 2010. 2010. Oh, okay. And then little by little. Yeah. So how is the patronage? Are people coming? Oh, it's been... oh, before Corona, we were always working well. Oh, okay. 
For sure. Yeah. 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 But I'm a spiritual person as well, but you know, with nature, you need to embrace nature. The only thing is I love it. And nature isn't it the work of the Almighty? Yeah. yeah, it is. It's the work of the cre the creation is the work of the creator. Exactly. To me is what gives me more contemplation. Exactly. Put your left foot in the matter. Okay. Grab the saddle front and this back. Side. Front and back. Lift up yourself, sit gently. Okay. Only the toes go into this spiral and okay. the heels go lower than the toes. Okay. Are you comfortable? Yes, I'm comfortable. Now. Okay, then grab the ropes okay. and never let them go. Now give me five minutes of your attention. Okay. So on my small ponies here, if you want to have a comfortable ride, it's important that the ropes I put in your hands. Yeah. You take them well. Okay. You take the ropes well. The first most important thing is to keep your arms stretched. Yeah. I do. So don't ride like this. Okay? Okay. You're gonna rather ride like this. Okay. Keep your arms and hands in front of okay. you, not on you. Even though you might feel more comfortable. It's like this you can take the ropes properly. Okay. To take the ropes properly means they should be neither too short. This is not okay. Okay. Nor too long. Okay? Right. Long ropes turn the horses. It's time to take a break and eat. Okay. So if the horse is eating all the time, it could be because the ropes are too long. Okay. But if you take them properly, in between, like this, yeah. you see they are not too short like this, yeah. and they are not too long you will be able to ask the horse everything okay. starting from stop okay. or slow down this one when you are riding i tell you stop the horse you I will pull, pull your hands in your belly okay it will bring pressure in the mouth of the horse the okay. horse understands okay. you want it to stop okay. if you pull softly it will slow down right. turning the horse we push the neck to where we want to go so like if i want to go left mm, i'm going to push with. the neck with the rope okay okay All right. if i want to go right i'm going to give the neck to the right okay okay right it works only if the ropes are adjusted well finally you will soon realize the horse is more interested in eating than in Riding. touring yeah so they need some stimulation to go otherwise they will always stop to eat okay the stimulation will come from the back of your feet okay the heels both of them right and left okay. you take you grab the horse in between your heels and squeeze okay you must feel the body of the horse right. when you do so you ask the horse to go move. Go. Are you trying to go to go? Okay? Okay. Do you have any questions? No questions. No questions. Okay. But you can always ask. I will lead the way going so that you see where we pass. You will lead the way back. Okay. So how many horses do you have so far? Eight. Come again. Eight. Eight. Yeah. Wow. Expensive, right? So where did you buy them from? Okay, I didn't buy them this price. Now I can share the value of this price. Oh, okay. I bought them from like Mark Martin. Okay. But I also uh, bought some even from it. Okay. Miss Elodie is an European from France. 
who is married to a Ghanaian, visiting Ghana for the first time. She fell in love with the lake and decided to move with her family to put up the green ranch in Ghana. The ranch has eight horses and with her certification from horse rides, riding horseback with her makes it easy for a novice like me. The horses are very calm and gentle and listen to simple instructions by the control of the rope. We have an art to explore the beautiful natural surroundings around the Lake Bosomche. Yeah. I want to be in the nature. I... Miss Elodie finds peace, good health and serenity living in the countryside. An un place where they told you what to chase told you how to run the race every move was on the page but i didn't like their way had to fight and misbehave had to find a way to change had to leave to find my way caught up in a daydream i beat my mind up there almost daily it's how i pass time no opinions safely it's how i understand what i want in this place see because everybody want to tell you bad things what could go wrong what fame brings but success is a finicky thing and if you ain't sure no it'll never be I don't wanna let myself down, myself down Surface a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need What you need We're broken, Where I want it's for tragic Why we're do not I regret all this? Elastic, in my mind that bliss Lots of feeling endless Sitting up on breath with anxiety and infectious I feel so defenseless Betrayed and embarrassed I hate being open, so I hate being broken I feel like an ocean filled up with emotion Anger in a potion, brother on a lotion I can feel it soaking, it open, the scars have awoken I can't move on to let it go I feel so lost, never let go So much, never let go. It's 
about personal life reason for setting up this project and it's really an amazing experience uh, i would urge everyone to come down and then explore the green ranch it's an amazing place the reception is very very nice and i i i tell you you're gonna love this experience you're gonna love it so just come down those in the diaspora watching please come down and then experience the feel of nature in ghana thanks so much for coming along with me throughout this journey. Also hit the subscription button and let's increase the following. Thank you.